there's a revolution on the way. It's the 5G revolution. Although some say this will be more like an experiment that will affect billions of people. 5G stands for fifth generation mobile services. The internet will be faster than ever. Downloading a high definition movie will take mere seconds. By 2025, the European Commission is planning for all urban areas across the continent to have seamless 5G coverage. This will enable a new age in the Internet of Things. Smart driverless cars and smart hospitals, smart fridges, coffee makers and even baby diapers. But what citizens are not told is that for this to happen, countless new antennas will be added. In our neighborhoods, our workplaces, even in our homes. Are mobile communications dangerous? The scientific community is divided. Some experts maintain they are safe, others have serious concerns. In 2011, the WHO classified electromagnetic fields associated with cell phones as possibly carcinogenic to humans. And studies published in 2018 showed that when rats were exposed to such fields, it increased their risk of certain types of cancer. Even among those who believe the technology is safe, many admit that more studies are needed. And for 5G, there are almost no studies. Telecom companies themselves have noted that electromagnetic signals may pose health risks. So why are the EU Commission and our governments turning a blind eye? They cite guidelines established by transnational scientific bodies. But Investigate Europe has found that these bodies are closed clubs. People with dissenting opinions are not invited in. And a significant number of the scientists involved have received funding from companies with vested interests in the 5G rollout. There is no risk-free society. Other things we consume are also bad for our health, from alcohol to junk food. But if you don't want a hamburger, you can simply avoid hamburgers. With 5G, there is no opt-out.